Hello everyone, Mountain of Roses. Welcome back to our video tutorial on how to use OBS or Open Broadcaster software. In this lesson, you will learn how to use OBS for live streaming. It's either Facebook Live or YouTube Live. So, first is you need to set up your mainstream display on your live stream video. So, first is you need to add some images if you want to add some Im image okay go then place it depends on what you like or where you like and then add some media source for example i want to to add the the video clip of pudge the the dancing um he uh, hero of dota dota 2 so it's a green screen and then okay that's him so i will um remove his um, green screen background the same process um, right click or go to the sources and right click fil click the filters and then go to effect eff effect filters and click the plus symbol and click the chroma key and then okay so so it's now done next if I want if I, wa I want to add something I will also input like uh, another video for example um, video number two if ever I wanted to play another video like example this kiddo or example Santa of course I will click the loop so that the the video will play repeatedly okay and to remove the green screen if, um, background again click filters and then go to effect filters click the plus symbol and go to chroma key or click chroma key okay so as you notice i on, i have now the two dancing um animated uh video the santa and the fudge okay so to make your um, um live stream very interesting okay because it Dota 2 it's it's an online game and this two can can be considered as uh, an enemy or or an opponent because uh, I place them on on the both sides so I he also have here another um, images the versus images okay so here so this images is um, a PNG file file so when I inserted it in my um, mainstream di mainstream display, it will look like as a transparent images. So here, all right. Now, if 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 I want to add some timer on my um, on my uh, mainstream display, I will just add the green screen video that I downloaded the timer. So I will browse and look for the timer okay here it is the 10 minute timer and again loop and then click the restart playback okay here it is so as you notice you can see the timer on the screen okay so i will remove the green screen background so that it will become transparent the same process <coughs> okay now that's it so now um, the background is very black so to make it very um, um, overwhelming when you look at the screen let us uh, add another background video let's name it as background and then choose a file depends on what kind of background you want I have here a hmm Wait, I'm going to, to locate where the background video is. Okay, so for example, this is my background video. I am going to insert this background video and click the loop again and then okay so so as you notice guys that the um, background video that, that I displayed is covering the whole display that I created so you need to go to the sources and 
click the background uh, file and move it down so that all your um, output will be displayed and it will become the background itself okay so that's it so now if you think that you are ready you need to go to uh, Facebook or YouTube okay first let's go to Facebook so we have here a page a private page and we are going to test on how to um, do live streaming so go to your page click the live and then when you click the live you need to click next just wait for it so you are going to copy the stream key okay the stream key is very important because it will um, help help the OBS and Facebook connect okay so copy the stream key and go to your OBS and go to settings then click the stream and on the service you need to choose Facebook live because you are going to have a live stream in Facebook so remove the stream key and paste the, fa the stream key on the Facebook okay and click apply and okay so now let's go to Facebook okay just click next and then insert some title for example testing um, live streaming sir my quapo okay so when you click the start streaming the Facebook will notify you if you are allowed or if you are ready to do the live stream click next and go live to make your mainstream display you need to do the, do the transition so that your um, camera display will automatically um, shown on the viewers um, camera display or on what they uh, during they watch your live streaming okay so let's go back from the from this part so let's try to look the stream if you successfully stream your OBS let's check if let's search high cool okay so here 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 it is you are Stream. now currently we are now currently OBS. live let's search high cool so that is on how to do live stream in OBS okay. with so Facebook here, here, here it is all right you are now Stream currently we so next live stream we will end this video guys huh? next live stream will be on YouTube okay so we'll open the youtube.com make sure that you have an account in YouTube and then go to your account and click this plus button and then click go live And then you need to stop the stream because the the stream key that the stream key that you used is for Facebook Live. And now we are going to use the stream key of YouTube. Okay. So the stream key of YouTube is here. Okay. So you just need to um, copy the the stream key. Copy. And then go to OBS, go to settings, click the stream, change the service into YouTube 
RT MPS and then paste the stream key apply and OK and then click start and then check your YouTube channel if you are up to live all right so hopefully you understand again what we are um, um, having uh, what I am I am teaching you right now so thank you again for um, listening and have a great day hopefully that you will apply all the um, video discussions or the tutorial that we that I created for this training all right see you and au revoir